What's up, everybody? <laughs> it's your boy Uchi, and I'm uh, back again. Once again. How y'all doing today? How doing today? Okay. okay, so we are actually going to be doing something for the first time we haven't done ever, and that is to do some comic reacting, reviewing, and uh, of course, we're going to be doing some Power Rangers. Now, this is the first time I'm doing this, but this is kind of similar to how I used to and still do manga reactions where I will actually have a visual for you guys. But obviously, the whole point is just so that you can kind of follow along. But I do obviously have the intention of sharing with y'all that you should obviously be supporting the official releases because that's what I'm all about. And uh, yeah, this, there, there's nothing different here. Obviously, this is a comic book. This is the, the first comic book series, aside from manga, like I said, that we'll be doing. Um, and I will be doing them. So as long as I'm able to, and hopefully in time, I will be able to you know, do more live reads like this. If not, we'll probably have to change over to review format. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Okay, so basically this is number five. So we're starting with Mighty Morphin 5. This, for those that don't know, if you're new to the channel, you're just tuning in, or if you have no idea what this series is going, what's going on right now in the series, Mighty Morphin and Power Rangers are actually two separate issues that coincide with each other. You can actually read them in release order to get the, uh, I guess, the like canonical or the like, um the, the 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 actual order of the events the series of events that are happening um and they're literally going back to back so this week is mighty morphin in two weeks is going to be power rangers and i believe power rangers is also going to have its fifth issue um and right now this issue is a very great one because we're actually going to get the origin story to our brand new green ranger yes you heard me correctly brand new green ranger it's not tommy oliver it's not another tommy it's not draken it's actually a character whom we might already be familiar with um and we're, we're just gonna get right into it right here okay want to know a secret i am no hero angel grow five weeks ago so this is somewhat recent then okay i'm not even sure i've ever been a, in a real fight I mean, I punched Chris Richardson in the fourth grade when he stepped on one of my comics, but that's about it. No, when things get scary, I run, okay? And I can run pretty fast. I'm not proud of it, but it's the truth. So he's an honest man, I appreciate that. Anything that I've ever done that is even remotely brave was out of a complete and abject terror. But do me a favor, okay? Don't tell anyone. Relax, kid. You're not dead. Not any, not yet, anyway. Matthew Cook. This is who we're talking about. So Matt Cook, he has already been in the story. We already have been aware of Matt. And actually, funny enough, if you're not really connecting the dots here, funny enough, this guy actually dated Kimberly before Tommy did. Just putting that out there. It's kind of weird how Kim has essentially been involved with uh some people that have mantled the green ranger and all that kind of stuff so that's just a little food for thought so matthew cook gray sterling this is promethea usually i'd give you my big sales pitch and wine and dine you accordingly but we just don't have the time you saw the giant monster battle outside yes well the city is about to fall your friends are in trouble and i have a way of potentially evening the score but there's a chance you might not survive so so what do you say are you interested what do i have to do all right people we're on the clock here so now we're going back to oh, okay oh that is, that is grace right now okay so we're still in promethea fire up the dagger and begin the energy exchange andrea you've got two minutes to prep the subject no mistakes or you're all fired matt have you eaten anything in the last four hours um I think half a protein bar. And do you take any prescription drugs besides doxycycline? Oh my God, no. I, wait, how do you know that? Tarona engage, quarantine protocols. If anything goes wrong, I want it contained to the main lab. Safeguards are set. Grace, are you sure you wanna do this to the kid? Like we have a choice. Matthew, whenever you're ready, just grab the Morphoran. Yell Dragon's Lord. <laughs> Yo, this is so cool. I'm not even gonna lie. This is actually like this is this is fire. Alright, I, I love I love this so far. And like 
I never would have imagined myself being excited to see someone else being, you know, Green Ranger. I mean, we've seen plenty of Rangers mantle and dawn other colors that they weren't originally or even get the powers passed on, but never would we ever imagine seeing the Green Ranger from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers get passed on to someone else that wasn't already Tommy. I mean, it makes sense, Lord Draken, he is he is Tommy from another freaking universe altogether, okay? So he gets a pass because Mans literally took green and white, boom, and made his own thing, right? Something that we've all probably kind of wondered or thought up in our heads at some point. But yeah, so here we go. Just like Abracadabra. All right, here we go. Dragon Sword. All right, it's like, oh, yo, that's fire. Look at that. Oh, yes. That looks so clean. Wow, it actually worked. Congratulations, Grace. You're now the proud owner of your very own brand new Power Ranger. Yeah. That's so sick. That is that is wallpaper worthy right there. I'm gonna need that animated. Now let's see if he lives through the day. Matt, that skinless red linebacker with the walking stick is Lord Zed. He's a big and bad he's as big and bad as they come, so stay ready. Um he can't hear you, right? <laughs> I like him. He's he, he's pretty he's very new to this, you could tell, obviously. No, we're on a closed feed. That way we can talk. Excuse me. And you stay dark and mysterious. Good. So, is now a bad time to mention I can't fight really good? Yes, it's a very bad time. But I've seen you play football. You're a, a gifted athlete, so just stay focused. And let the coin do the rest. So, is that implying that the dragon coin is essentially giving him... Obviously, not just the power, but the ability to, I guess, defend himself in a very, like, combatant type of way. Okay. This guy is trying to kill me. Of course, for you. Man's is fighting Lord Zed on his first day on the job. Like, that's that's crazy. Talk about getting thrown right into the, the, sweet, uh, the heap of things. Well, try to kill him back then. Oh, he gets the... Yeah! Well, he's probably not going to say it like Tommy, but, you know. He got, the, he got that nice super kick in there and the gut check. See, you're a natural. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> you're trying to figure out his weakness before he figures out yours. I can feel the chaos energy flowing through you. This is not Zordon's doing. Who are you? What? Matt, my people are telling me that the crystal at your feet has the same energy signature as that terror sword. It does, so I should smash it then, right? No, no, stop, you'll kill us. Oh, and then it, when the bad guy yells no, do the opposite. Oh my God, so he destroyed the green chaos energy crystal. Grace, power levels are dispersing. The terror resort is frozen. Matt, are you all right? And he's coughing, ouch, you're fine. And you gave the power rangers a fighting chance. So is his power also made up and comprised of that same crystal? Because it I mean he he clearly took damage. Like he he clearly took damage. I don't know. Maybe it was the power emitting from it. Maybe I'm not sure. We'll find out, hopefully. Now let's get our Green Ranger out of there. I know I did the exact same thing after my first mission. Took off my helmet, stared into the visor, and asked, Am I still me? Spoiler, you are. And no. You never get to get used to it. My friends, are they? The rangers are fine. They took care of the terror sword like clockwork. And aside from a few broken buildings, the city's still there. It's still here. And that's partly thanks to you. Well, I've never been that scared in my entire life. But it was nice to play the hero for a few minutes. And those few minutes, is that all you want? I'll admit, you weren't my first choice, but Billy thinks you have all the qualities it takes to be a ranger, and he can be very persuasive. So I did my homework, and Miss Sterling, I hate to burst your bubble, but that out there, that was 87% luck. I'm not high pressure. I'm not a high pressure guy. I mean, I failed my driver's test like three times. <laughs> wow. 
if my friends need help, I'll do what I can. But fighting monsters and saving the world, that's not really, for, really, really me. Really. When Rita Repulsa kidnapped and imprisoned you on the moon, did you wait for the rangers to come save you? Or did you maybe do it yourself? That's not the same. I thought I was going to die. And instead of sitting there and waiting for it to happen, you did something about it. So they're going back and forth. Okay. Sounds like a power ranger to me. But what do I know? I only was one. Yo, that's facts. I forget Grace was was a Power Ranger. She was the, she was the Red Ranger, I think, back in the day. Like I think it was the 1970s team or something, something like that. I forget. It's been a while since we read those issues. But that's a great backstory. Definitely check that out. Uh, don't get me wrong. It's easy not going to it. It's not going to be easy. I'm not going to be nice to you, and I'm going to ask you to do things you won't like or even understand. And you're going to have to keep it all a secret. Because the minute Zordon finds out what we're doing, he's going to try and shut us down. What's a Zordon? <laughs> we'll get to that. Suffice to say, I don't agree with all the Rangers rules. They're focused on keeping the world safe, but I actually want, it, want to make it better. I was a Power Ranger for all of one mission, and then it was taken away from me. So I'm going to give you the choice I never had. Do you want to go back to watching your friends fight from the sidelines? Or do you have what it takes to get in the game? So now we're four weeks ago. So, so far, I really do like how this story is kind of playing out. And I do appreciate Matt's character because he's like very, very like true to himself he's a very realistic and i i can see him being very relatable to maybe a lot of other you know people in general that might be reading this i mean like i didn't feel my driver's test three times i nailed that john on the first try thank you very much but he like he's very honest and i do appreciate that i really do like that a lot which makes me like him more as a character because he's not like cocky he's not arrogant he's not like trying to boast or be like oh like oh, i'm the freaking green ranger son like i'm in there like no he's not like that at all and i really i really do like that he's super humble i guess is the best way to put it i don't understand you quit the team there are more important things than football mom yeah it's called college and without a scholarship i don't know how you're going to going what? I don't know how you're... Okay, how, how you're going. Football was your ticket to a good education. Matt, you should have at least told us first. I wanted to. If you haven't been going to practice, what have you been doing? I've been volunteering. Cleanup crews, community outreach, stuff like that. I mean, you've seen the craziness out there. I wanted to help, and I couldn't do that and football at the same time. Does this community outreach happen to have really long legs? Matt... If you'd oh damn his mom's OD. If you'd rather plant trees than play football, it's your life and we'll support you either way. Right, Olivia? <sighs> of course. We'll give you your space and freedom. But if you want us to trust you, you can't keep secrets like this from us. You know, his parents are really cool too. You wanna know why? Because usually, typically, we see what just happened, that 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 conversation go more alongside with the father yelling at the kid about staying in, in sports and you know you know what about college and stuff like that it was, it was reversed low-key and where, where the mother is the more compassionate one tries to reason and uh you know like uh like just to kind of show that sympathetic side and to obviously still remind them that you know they're so they're supported of whatever they're trying to do but obviously they got to be more communicative because it's that's good. He's, I mean, he's, all, 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 he's got good parents either way, no matter which role or how you're flipping it or whatever. But great, great, great story so far here. Uh, welcome back, Ranger Stationeers. Uh, it is I, Bulk, your faithful guide and co-founder of Ranger Station, the exclusive home for all things Power Rangers. Behind the camera, as always, is my faithful companion, Skull. Hello. On today's episode, we're getting the word on the street about the return of a channel favorite, the Green Ranger. Where did he go? Why is he back? And what's with the new look? It's not like I pay attention, but one minute he's against them, the next he's with them, now he's whatever. What happens if he tries to destroy the city again? That's actually really funny. Personally, I dig the new outfit. A little more bling, a little more sting. Two thumbs up. Is that Adam that said that? Who is he? Well, are we certain it's a guy? 
people aren't always who they appear to be just saying and that is she is um f not even from earth so yeah that that's definitely a good uh, a good uh line to say from her for sure no mr volkmeyer this does not count as your midterm essay now please return to your seat damn oh, oh there goes matt right there no comment come on now don't overcommit yeah and watch your six okay you know some people actually get better with training no pivot and counter like i showed you tell your men to settle down and okay i've seen enough i'm sorry is this too hard if these guys go easy on you in here you'll die out there which is fine for me because i'll just draft someone else but i'm not keen on you jeopardizing my coin got it you're all heart grace <laughs> let's go again nope i can't i can't watch that anymore besides we have an appointment follow me it's time to introduce you to your partner <laughs> let's go let's go great what kind of training are we doing now laps across the bay matt if i were you i wouldn't give her any ideas Billy, good to see you, man. I hear I have you to thank for my current ranger status. Wait, are you my new partner? <laughs> no, sadly, I'm not tall enough. Here, I made a few minor adjustments. It's stronger, lighter, and has an advanced kinetic energy discharge attack. <laughs> but most importantly, the dragon dagger isn't just a weapon, Matt. It's also a harmonic control device for your zord. Zord? Yeah, that's not a real word. <laughs> Once you place the dagger to your faceplate, you should hear the musical notes in your head. See if you can play them. Right? English, Billy. You're not playing the flute. The flute is playing you. And with the right combination of notes, it can summon the mighty dragon Zord. The best the best of the freaking best right there whoa so that's um mine i mean i get to drive that actually that's mine all right grace this she gotta chill because that ain't yours either now nah, you might you might have ownership because you 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 know no no do not disrespect nah it's his right now, but we all know who it really belongs to, okay? So let's not, let's stop, let's stop capping out here, okay? My man's got a master morpher later on in the story, okay? All right, go to Soul of the Dragon. That's, that takes place way after Dimensions in Danger. Go watch it, okay? Man's has the whole, all the rights to his own stuff still, okay? I want to hear it. Yeah, best to think of it as a rental. Mm hmm That's the best way to put it, Billy. Billy and my engineers made a few modifications to the original design. Improved armor, enhanced weaponry, and even a surprise for a special occasion. Mm. Tell me Dragon's Lord has a new battle mode. Tell me he has a new battle mode. We'll find out. Let's give them uh, time to get acquainted, Billy. Of course. Hey there, buddy. I'm Matthew. He's so nice. It's a pleasure to meet you. Okay, that's one double protein powder papaya peanut butter power shake. Anything else I can get you? I'm good, Ernie. Unless you know how to get rid of a song that's endlessly playing in your head. <laughs> yeah, I really do like Matt. I'm not gonna lie. He's really cool. Uh, chew Oh, this is one week ago now. Chew gum? I get 80s earworms stuck in my head all the time. So I pop a piece of gum 30 seconds later, all gone. Cross my heart. Thanks. I'll give it a try. Hey, um, Rocky mentioned you quit the football team? Yeah, trying to stay on my grades. And your parents were okay with that? Not exactly, but I saw you got a new Green Ranger, huh? Must be nice. Yeah, it'd be a whole lot nicer if we actually knew who they were. Oh, um, you don't have any ideas? Nope. We'll, well... We thought we did, but then they got taken into space, so, of course. Right. Oh, yeah, okay, I did forget. Obviously, Matt knows who they are um, because of a prior 
like you know situation read 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 comics bro i'm telling you it's great this is great stuff right here you know it's weird everyone else is kind of freaking out over it but when i'm around this new ranger i'm not scared i'm not worried i just feel safe maybe i can't even really describe it but it seems like they're on our side i'm probably crazy of course they'll turn out to be an alien who wants to murder all of us or something that's that shakes good by the way <laughs> i don't know i just feel sorry for them i couldn't imagine trying to be a ranger out there all by myself at least or at least i had my friends you know well maybe it's like you and me maybe they really want to reach out but they can't because maybe something or someone won't let them maybe but rules were meant to be broken right yeah kimberly i of course power ranger power rangering calls it's nice to be able to actually just tell you that. <laughs> Everything okay? Yep. Just remember, chew gum and don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. Dude, I love this comic. Th th like, this is... This shit... Okay, th this is too good. Like, it, it is it's too good. Like, I, I truly hope that all of this gets adapted into a freaking movie, TV show, animated series a video game something more than just a video game to be honest okay the first three options i said has to be priority all right but like the writing is so good like i love it like i love the dialogue like all the callbacks all the references like it, it's just it's is the the detail is all there okay and i and i know I, I like how i'm reviewing this as i'm reading it you're getting the full reaction this is how this is like literally how i would be off camera anyway so all right, so we got the we got a fight now. So now it's today. Now it's current day. All right, Andrea, any problems with the 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 drag the DZ he calls it? All systems were green. No pun intended. Five by five. Matthew, how about you? Considering I'm driving a robot lizard the size of a building with nothing but a magic flute, I think I'm doing pretty good. Oh, he's not even inside it. Don't get cocky. If we're gonna take this giant putty out we're gonna need to combine the dragon sword and the white tiger sword and we're a hundred percent certain we can do that yes i'd give it a solid one in four chance combination sequence calibrated matthew whenever you're ready roger that <sighs> there's a first time for everything right do 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 okay hold on let's see White Tiger Sword, power up. Dragon Sword, power up. Come on, baby. Come on. Come. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, hold on. Did that, did that come from Zed? He doesn't have that kind of, the WTZ and, oh, the White Tiger Sword and Dragon Sword are down. Systems are non-responsive. Um, guys, something's happening to the sky. It's like a massive fireworks field or something. Mr. Sterling, what are your orders? Can you hear me? Okay, I'm going to I'm going to head down to street level. There has to be something I can do. Okay, so something's going on with that combination. So they think that Zed zapped it. I don't know what's happening. I don't even want to predict what could possibly happen, but the fact that we're already getting T's, Dragon Sword, White Tiger Sword combination, those are Tommy's uh, Zords, and this is a, a revamped Dragon Sword. So that's OD. There we go. Everyone, get inside. Hurry. Don't wait for me. Run, run. Violet, look out. Who is Violet? Anyway. Yeah! Right? Here we go. Ooh. My man punted his whole head off. Are you alright? I didn't get you, did I? I'm fine, but I thought you ran away with the other rangers. Ran away? What do you mean? The Power Rangers teleported out just as the shield came down. Apparently, we're on our... Look out! More of those things are coming this way. Go, find some place to safe to hide safe to hide. I'll keep them Wait, no, no! Oh, he's getting teleported. Oh, good. He's finally back. Toronto, give him a quick debrief. Essential info only. Everyone else, I need you to focus. We all have loved ones out there, but you can protect them best by doing your job in here. Understood? Alright, first things. Grace, the city's under siege and people are running scared. Yeah. Can we teleport them to the outside before? We're trapped here too. 
We can't teleport through the shield only in wait we can't teleport through the shield only inside of it and that's just one of the thousand one of a thousand problems i'm dealing with now take a step back be quiet and let me handle this we're implanting the landslide protocol i'm quarantining the entire compound no one in in or out full tactical radio silence no excuse me your answer is just hide away in here that's it we can't do that let me let me take a security team and they aren't soldiers they're men and women with very little training who don't possess the benefits of a power coin zed would slaughter you all in five minutes look I know you have people out there, but yes, I do, and they're terrified. I saw it. First, they watched the Power Rangers run, and then they saw me do the same. They need to know that they're not alone, and that we haven't abandoned them. I'm already planning a citywide radio broadcast requesting people uh, conserve food and water, stay in their homes, and remain calm. This isn't an Amber Alert, Grace. It's an alien invasion. People aren't going to listen to some voice on the radio. Then who will, will they listen to? Me. They'll listen to me. Yo, this is fire. Oh, my God. Okay. Yo, like, this, oh, my God. Okay, okay, okay. You're serious? You lie long enough. You, you lie long enough and no one believes you when you need them to. If we want people to actually trust us, Let's show them that I'm not some faceless alien from another planet, but that I'm just like them. I want my friends and family to know the truth, Grace. And when they do, hopefully, they'll handle it better than I did. Matthew, once you reveal your identity to the world, it's going to change your life forever. Oh, I think we're way past that. You said to yourself, I don't agree with the Rangers rule, right? Well, rules were made to be broken. If we're going to make the world better, let's do it our way. Out in the open, no more secrets, no more deception. And we start right now with Angel Grove. Damn. And that's the... Ah! Oh, damn, it's the last page. Of course it is. Of course it is. Well, let me tell you something right now. I am very, very, very happy about how this issue turned out. This is a very great and elaborate to the point but just enough detail kind of backstory to um give us the full scope on matt okay and i'm not gonna lie prior to this okay i like i said i just could not i can't visually picture anybody else other than tommy freaking oliver mantle that green ranger outfit okay he was he was the only one to do it he was and he and he's done it multiple times over throughout all of the power transfers and all of the transitions from series to series throughout all all of that we have seen my man through many different colors but his first one was always the green ranger and will always be the green ranger and probably the favorite you know amongst all of his colors among a lot of fans okay let's be honest that's the truth even so to the point current day dimensions in danger came out a few years ago but when you heard this man pull out the master morpher he said dragons come on it just feels perfect and it is right okay and I, like i said i bring all this up because never would i have ever imagined that i would be okay with seeing anyone else let alone someone that we've never even actually seen as a power ranger yeah, this is this is dude's first time ever and not for anything his story is is well obviously it's a little different from tommy's because tommy kind of uh you know he he kind of got put into that position um, forcefully in a way um kind of and he turned evil before going good and in this case he matt was kind of recruited off of recommendation from billy and considering that matt already knows the identity of the power rangers and he's keeping that secret within himself because i mean he knew off association just because he was involved in like they mentioned in this story he got kidnapped and they saved him so um he you know he showed some promise even then during that little mission where they had to go save him and it's not like he just like sat around and waited for it he did something so he's been showing those little bits of signs of you know potentially maybe one day he'll be a ranger 
and boom there he is right then and there so i you know when you think about it like that matt has kind of almost setting himself up to be a ranger and uh, and like i said i'm 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 totally with it i'm cool with it and i and i do like i i like how this issue took the time to really get a better understanding of how matt is overall he's a humble dude he's very honest but he's always willing to reach out to those that are in very dire need i mean even when there is an alien attack man does not even know how to really fight yet he's he's losing to the people that are training him but when he's literally on the field like he's doing all that he can to just you know make make uh, uh uh make make it make his way by or something like that and i i just i really do appreciate all of the story that uh has come from this and from him and i do like how uh it's set up basically to how the last issue ended with him revealing his face so now the next issue is gonna be um, even crazier, I'd imagine, because now that everything is fully understood and we know where everyone's coming from, now let's see how things, uh, how how they turn out, and let's see what Zordon does, because Zordon, like they said, and like they mentioned, he's not very happy with uh, how Grace has kind of, you know, taken her own, you know, will, if you will, and kind of implemented it into how she wants to do things and how she wants to change things because of what happened with her and she's doing a lot of what she's doing because of you know her own personal issues but i mean that's kind of like how a lot of stories are how they unfold in the first place but overall my review of the entire issue itself was this was a, a fantastic issue like i said guys if you're not reading these comics you absolutely have to it is so worth it i will always be an advocate for not just power rangers but for this freaking comic line all together ever since it started i think what back in 2016 2015 one of those years as soon as number one came out i was all in i feel like i own every single issue including the annuals and i'm starting trying to get them deluxe editions okay so i always say this as and this is my first reaction re re review of any of the comic book series when i'm gonna start doing them as they happen okay as every issue comes out i'm gonna you know do my best to keep up with them and, and do them for you guys and I'll tell you this right now, if this story was what we got as kids for the TV show, I'm pretty sure Power Rangers would be way more popular, way more loved and renowned than it is today. Right now, the nostalgia is a really, 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 uh, you know, doing a, a great job with keeping it relevant and um, I guess like f frequent, I suppose. And it's because of us, okay, let's not be, let, let's not lie, it's because of us. When I say us, I mean like anyone who within my age range, older or maybe a little bit younger, it's because of us we are keeping this IP afloat, okay? And through the comics, through mediums like this, this is only lighting that fire, even, even stronger, hotter. So if you, again, if you have not started these comics, I promise you, start picking them up, start reading them, let me know your thoughts, and I, I you will not regret it. I have a whole channel. I actually have several channels dedicated to the comic book series in the Battle for the Grid server. As you, some of you all might already know me for being the community leader for Power Rangers Battle for the Grid, the founder of the Discord itself. And yes, I made sure that there's a section for people to discuss each arc all right, there's a spoiler-free zone. There's a non-spoiler-free zone, okay? So, you got to read the comics. I keep saying that. I'm going to say it every single time. You got to read the comics. I can't wait for the next issue, I believe. Like I said earlier, the next issue should be Power Rangers number five. This was Mighty Morphin number five. Power Rangers number five. We're going to go back into space, take a look at what's going on with the Omega Rangers and Draken, like they uh, quickly mentioned here when they... They presumed that Draken was the new Green Ranger, and it's not, which I'm very happy about because that would have been very predictable, as everyone pretty much called that. Um, and uh, and we'll, we'll see what's going on out there in space. And then after that, we're actually going to have a one-shot with Astronema. They're going back to space, and they're smart for doing that because aside from the Mighty Morphin stuff, the next most popular and I think most successful 
uh, things to, 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 to capture on and to take advantage of because of its popularity is Power Rangers in Space. I believe the Psychopath graphic novel has been the best book aside from the others that they put out. Soul of the Dragon, they had the, the, Sins, of the uh, Sins of the Future, I think what it was called for the Time Force. And then Psychopath, Psy Psychopath came out before, okay? Psychopath came out before Sins of the Future. Sins of the Future was pretty good. Soul of the Dragon was great, but Psychopath has not been outdone. And I feel like once they really do, uh, they, they, they add more space flavors to this, then that's how we're gonna start seeing a little bit more of other things I think implemented into the story. And I'm really happy and I cannot wait to see how Astronema plays into this entire thing. Are we gonna see some space cameos? Are we gonna see my man Andros, Zane, TJ? So, like, I, I, I'm thinking crazy things right now, but that's, that's what happens. So anyways, guys, let me know your thoughts in the comments below like subscribe me up on twitter all that good stuff supporting supporting links are always going to be in the description for your um supporting pleasure viewing pleasure whatever and if you did enjoy this make sure you are liking this video like i said and let me know in the comments and let me know all your thoughts if you did read it um and if you haven't read it please also let me know that and if i helped you helped influence you to start reading this then please do do me a favor and let me know that as well. Take care, guys. May the power protect you. Keep it locked, loaded right here on this channel. Stay safe, stay clean, and stay inside. I'll see y'all next time.